Michigan U.S. Senator Gary Peters is in East Lansing today seeing how the federal government can help Michigan blueberry and cherry growers fight invasive insects. News 10's Cody Butler also talked to him about other issues facing Michiganders, including the economy and border security. While Senator Gary Peters was in East Lansing, he's still thinking about how the country can avoid hitting the debt ceiling. Republicans are trying to tie the budget cuts to raising the debt limit, while Peters, who serves on the Appropriations Committee, says those are different conversations. We're looking at ways to make sure we spend taxpayers' money uh, efficiently and try to, to uh, bring down uh, spending uh, as well, but that's part of the normal process that we go through every year. That's the appropriate place to be debating. Peter's visit to MSU comes just hours after a pandemic-era ban on migrants crossing into the U.S. ended. Many Republicans have criticized letting the rule expire, but Peters says there are more rules for migrants who cross the border than ever before. If they just show up at the border, they will not be allowed in uh, and they will be banned from coming into the country for many years. An MSU political scientist Matt Grossman says you can expect more of these types of policy shifts from the Biden administration since last year's election. Policy is actually likely to move in a little bit of a conservative direction because the Republicans uh, gain control of the House of Representatives. Peters is hoping Congress can come together to find solutions. In East Lansing, Cody Butler, News 10. Senator Peters says he's also asking the FBI and the Department of Homeland Security to show him how they are prioritizing domestic terrorism investigations.